What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another video here on my channel, and this is going to be a game of The Price is Right, the DOS, again, this time, but this time we have more people playing, not just me and Christine, well, even though I do, you know, host it sometimes and I do play too, but I also, we also picked up somebody else to play with us, and that is none other than the Bundy Chick. Yay! Hello! Been a while since uh, she's been on here, so... Um, I did a recent game of it, and she figured, you know, well, she saw the video we did, and I said, well, maybe we'll do another game of this, so, let's just get this. How set. bad can it be? <laughs> exactly. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me, uh, put the share screen, and if everybody can't see it, you know, it's okay, but. There we go. Whee! Do -do -do -do. Here it comes from the Steve K Studio in Baltimore, Maryland. Television's most exciting hour, fantastic prizes, the fabulous price is right. And here we go. Of course, nobody really cares for this game a lot because of the way it is, but it's pretty funny to me. I mean, with all this cheap knockoff stuff, so we'll have three players. Three. Then first one, um... Um, Chris could be the first one. Alright, just uh, do that way. Nope, can't fit the whole thing. Okay, just do it that no, way. No, so, Yeah, um, no, that's the character she had last time. Yeah, so I'm um, going to do that one, and next one. And that will be Carla. And. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Um, and me. So. Please. I'll put a Steve N for this one to see how that goes, and I'll just be the guy with the glasses. Just, uh, the other one's just, nah, no, <laughs> and... Nah. Alright, and the other one is George, so you are the first four contestants on The Price is Right. And now, here's oh, your God. host, Steve K. What's up, everybody? Welcome to The Price is Right. Say hello to my friend, George Gray. No. <laughs> this game's from 1990, yeah. so here we go. All right, first item I ever bid is this 14K gold ring with seven diamonds a two and a two-carat weight. So, Chris, uh, what do you bid on this 14K gold ring? Uh, $2,000. $2,000. Carla? $699. Lovely. $699. I'll say $1,200. And George says $2,797. And the actual retail price of that ring is four thousand six hundred fifty-five dollars. Wow. And George is the winner. All right, go for gonna... him. Go find it. Just kidding. Yeah. And he's going to play correct price. So, um, oh boy. I think, um, so first one we have this portable CD player from Magnavox. Our good friends from Magnavox from sending that. Thank you. And we got a. Complete family table tennis set from Rears. <laughs> yep, hey, to see you. Hello, see you. Yes, really. <laughs> Thank you um, for getting um, for getting that out of the Rears. So, <laughs> oh, he lost. Um, he, he so he had to pretty much put the right price on it. Um, it was 198 for the CD player and 78 for the table tennis thing. So, okay, that's done. And next one is Karen. Come on down. You are the next contestant. Okay. Now we have this eight-piece set of imported china and chris what do you bid 200 200 <laughs> okay carla 499 499 oh, oh, not eight nine nine i'll say a thousand and karen says 1623 the actual retail price is 546 dollars and carla has one okay okay let's see what we get to play you get to play the dice game Oh, woohoo. <laughs> so, uh, first one, um, space is rule the dice. What is the price of this forehead programmable stereo VCR from Dull? Um, dull. Yeah, it's Dull, all right. So, what a Dull VCR. <laughs> all right, so, how do we do this? I'm really not sure, like, how. Okay, um,. All right, it's a one. Yeah. So, um, I guess we gotta, oh. so we gotta guess the price of this. Do you think it, the one is higher or lower? Ooh, higher. Okay. All right, next one. It's another one. 
Higher. So, okay. Higher, yes. Now roll the dice. It's another one. <laughs> yeah. Yes. And the last one. <laughs> another one. Higher. Okay, let's Higher. let's see. Oh no, it was five hundred and thirty four dollars. What in the yeah, really, what in the world indeed? The dice game is played for a car. So Oh well. Yeah. That, Nobody perfect. Yeah, really. I mean that was a rip off. So anyway, that's it for that. Now our next contestant is Sanford. <laughs> Come on down. Sanford. And where's Where Sonnet? Yeah, really. Alright, now this next time I've ever bid is this portable C D player from T. And Chris, what have you been on this portable CD player? Four hundred. Okay. Sanford says at one hundred thirty-eight. I'll say mm, two fifty. And Karen says three thirteen. The actual retail price is one hundred sixty-eight dollars. And Sanford has won it off by just thirty dollars. And he's gonna play. Play Plinko. All right, first one. Um, what is the price of this remote control toy car from Radio Shed? And that would be Radio Shack, I'm pretty sure. Thank you for that. So, is it um, is it $12 well, or 14 Oh, crap. I meant to... Oh, man. I wanted somebody to play the computer. Oh, my God. All right. Say 12 No, it was 14 What is the price of a set of two <coughs> graphite Wilton. tennis rackets from Wilton? Thanks, Wilson. 130 or 155. You won a puck. Lovely. <laughs> you don't win a puck in Plinko. You win a Plinko chip. <sighs> what is the price of this beginner skis and pole set from K3? Mm, let's try that. No. Oh dear. And what is the price of this set of 3.5 inch double density disc from Ace? Ten. Yep, ten. One a puck. Okay, so now he gets to the board. Now there's the big five thousand slot, and he can win. He can win uh, fifteen thousand dollars if he can win all three in there. So here goes the first one. It's on his way down. It goes into five hundred dollars. One hundred. Now let's go to the next one. There it goes on its way. A thousand dollars. Fifteen hundred. Now one more puck or chip. Either one. A thousand. He's got twenty-five. Not too bad. And now it's time to spin the wheel, and George will spin it first. If he'd like to say hello to anybody, I'd ask him, but I don't know who you want to say hi to. But he is going to start with a forty-five, and he is going to spin again. <clears throat> fifty-five will be a dollar, or fifty, or forty-five. And he gets 60, and now it's Carla. Go! Go in the middle. Stop. Right here? or? Yeah. Okay. Slowing down, looking up. Not gonna get there. No time. Maybe 95, maybe... 85? 85? No. 30. Nope, you gotta spin again. Spin again. Um, same way in the middle, or... Oh. Yeah, oh. yeah, same way in the middle. Up. Oh. Right there, or a little low? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fun. Alright, here we go. 70 will be a dollar. 65 Not gonna will hit be... the 70, but... We'll see. Um, 75. 55 is too much. 55 will be it's good. Right. 55, not 95, not 95, not 95. 50, you got 80, alright. I'll take it. Alright, now sorry about the clock, folks. Now here goes Sanford. Has to be 80 cents to get into the showcase. And he looks like he's not. Mm, 55, double nickels. Spin again. A little bit of a light spin that was, and it's not going to be enough. Carla goes to the showcase. 
So now, since Carla's in the showcase, we'll just do two players this time, just be me and Chris, since considering we're still in contestants row. Remember two players. I got Steve. it. I got it. Two. So, here's Chris. And and me. Alright. Alright, we got Dave and Kim. Dave and Kim, that's right. And let's see what the next time of for bid is in the second half of The Price is Right. It's a new stereo CD player with equalizer from Nagnavox. <laughs> yep. Chris, what do you bid on this stereo CD player? 3000 Okay. <laughs> I'll say 500 Dave says 165 and Kim says 580 And the actual retail price... Is two hundred two 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 two. Dave top. So Dave is the winner, and he's gonna play take two. So first one is this tournament basketball hoop set from Scuffy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's Scuffy, all right. And this triple wash super dishwasher from Zapan. And then we got this two position. Massage recliner from Simons. Simon. <laughs> yeah, or Simmons, or whatever. Or, and this 35 millimeter autofocus camera from <laughs> Mikon. Couldn't afford <laughs> Nikon, so <laughs> now he has to pick two that add up to four and twelve dollars. And <clears throat> that didn't do it. Nope. Should have done the um. It's like the. the Should have done the hoop in the. I think the last prize didn't it? The 361 and the one who's in the hoop. But thank you for playing anyway. Who is the next contestant? It's Ken. Come Ken. on down. Now get over there. <laughs> Alright, next item I ever bid is this 10k yellow gold ring with a diamond. Chris, what do you bid? 200. Alright. I'll say if. I'll say. Uh, no, 1000. Ken says 736, and Kim oh. says 429. I say pancakes. <laughs> and the actual retail price is... Let's see what it is. 675, 675. and Kim Pancake. is the winner. Jeez. And she's going to play the danger price. Oh, and boy. The danger price is a game where you have to pick out four items, but you cannot pick the one as the danger price. First is a three-speed Ronnie Miller from John Elk, which would be John Deere. Yeah, elk. Nightmare on Elk Street. Anyway, Ooh. the small aluminum ping pong table from Cambridge. I never knew they made aluminum ping pong sets. <laughs> then we've got a split grid hide cover football from Wilton, Wilson's little cousin, and this junior plastic plastic fishing poles from Harris. Boy, flat plastic fishing poles, yeah. I'm ready to do some fishing right now. I don't know about you two, but anyway. So the danger price is fourteen dollars. So do not pick that. So, which one is he gonna go for? He's gonna go with that. That's sixty-six dollars. Yep. Very good. Now, which one is he gonna pick? The mower or that thing? Yep. What? Or or whatever it is. One thousand four hundred thirty-two dollars. Uh. Now, he needs to pick either between the football or the plastic fishing poles. I think pick... it might be the football myself. I, th I think the football is $14, but we'll see. Oh, it is $14, and I'm oh, sorry. I should have went with the plastic fishing pole. Yep, you should have. But that was a tough choice anyway. Thank you for playing. And now, who is the next contestant? It is Wayne. Wayne? Party time. Wayne Excellent. Come on down. Party time. <laughs> All right, Chris. What is a forbid is this recreational motorcycle from Honda? You mean Honda? Yes. Uh <laughs> Honda just didn't want to. We couldn't afford Honda, so we just pretty much had to go with the with Honda. So, what do you believe is the price of this? What do you believe is the price of this motorcycle? One hundred. All right. I'll say sixteen or no, sixteen hundred. Maybe one hundred. says oh. thousand seventy four, and Wayne four thousand four thirty nine, and the actual retail price is. Two thousand dollars, and I yay, won. Steve. Yay! Ding ding ding! <laughs> and I'm gonna play the range, range game. game. Uh, all right, so. Oh, brother. Um, the object of this game, I'm playing for a portable CD player with <laughs> equalizer from Pony. So. Pony. God, 
So I gotta guess like how much the price of this thing can be, and I cannot go over the price. <laughs> anyway, um, sorry, <laughs> it's okay. Embarrassing. <laughs> All right, so let's sorry, Carl. Oh, anybody want a pony? All right, I'll stop right there. Oh, it was three hundred and four. Oh my God, I thought you I had. You were so close. God, I didn't think it would be. That happens. That's okay. All right, now let's spin the wheel. Now we're on to thought... the big wheel. Whee! <laughs> That's what happens when you chilly a lot. I know, I'm... it's all right. <laughs> and he, Dave, is gonna start with a dime, and he's gonna spin again oh. for ten cents. Ninety, we'll give him a dollar. Eighty-five, eighty, seventy-five. Anything higher than a let's sixty. See what he did. Uh oh. No. Oop, he only got a ne nickel. So you got 15 nickel. cents. So here goes Kim. Yeah. It's got to be 15 cents. And... It's 70. That's good and enough. she's going to stay. Okay, so now it's my turn. Oop. you got to just beat 70 to play with me. And it's going to be... Oh, oh, five cents. Oh, five, five cents. Okay, so I gotta, so close, gotta spin. Gotta spin again. Yes, I have to spin again. And oof. here we go. Come on, let's go. Come on. Ninety-five or ninety. <laughs> Seventy. Or Seventy or seventy-five. Either one. And seventy-five's coming around. That's going too fast. Ninety-five be good. Stop, 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 stop. Eighty-five, maybe no. Um, I don't. So Kim is the winner. So we got oh, well, we got a well, K. And, the the we got two K's in the showcase, Kim and Carla. So who will win? Let's find out. Here we go as we begin the first showcase. This show and Carla will bid on this one, so okay. And here we go. Your showcase begins with this jet streaming racing sailboat from Shark. Oh, if you want to know, I'll finish the video. Then your next one is this five day round what? trip what? vacation to New York. Wait, I stepped away or something. I hear a noise. Oh, man. Oh, you're sorry, here? Just, oh, I'm sorry. Okay. I just had to sort something out. All right. All right. Next one is five-day round-trip vacation to New York and a 14-day cruise to Hawaii. And this showcase can be yours if the price is right. Um. Oh, I got $6,954. $6,954? Yeah. Okay. Got it. And now here is Kim's showcase. Your showcase begins with this leather modeler sofa set from <laughs> Simmons or Simons. <laughs> and then you got this solid oak table and chair set from Ravel. And this professional curling iron from Carol. She and... got a cheap uh sofa. Yeah, really. And that showcase can be yours if the price is right. And she bends ten thousand eight hundred and fifty-four dollars. What? Okay. <laughs> you both overbid, so we have to bid again. So, Great. All right. So less than six thousand nine hundred. Four thousand eight hundred and fifty. One more time. Four thousand eight hundred and fifty. Four thousand eight fifty. Got it. And Kim. Four thousand nine seventy-seven. Okay. Now let's see who wins. Carla, you're off by one thousand three fifty-seven, oh, and Kim is off by eight eighty-six, and Kim is the winner. Oh man. That's uh, alright. Yeah, that happens. Well, that's the way it goes. But that's the way this game is. I uh, hope everybody enjoyed that anyway. But. Yeah. I appreciate everybody for playing this game, one. too. Another day real soon, hopefully. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we'll see. I mean, maybe we can get more people to play in this, but we'll see. But but I appreciate um, everybody watching this, and of course appreciate Carla and Christine for playing this. So thanks You're again. welcome. 
So thanks again for watching this, and uh, as always, it's for to say for Bob Barker, I'm sure he won't mind, help control the pet population. Oh my have god! You, have your pet spayed or neutered. Goodbye, oh everybody. God. <laughs> Thanks again for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe. It's not a bad thing. It's a good thing. And you all take care. And thanks again for watching this video.